This film was created, shot and edited over three days. It was meant to be a spotlight on a Toronto based coffee bar, just like many that I'd done before. What I didn't expect was to find something beyond the coffee bar itself. I'm Bruce Lee. I've been in coffee for about 11 years now and I've been a competitive barista for about six years. I think any goal for any barista is to eventually open up their own cafe. And uh, with my business partner Masashi and I, we decided to open up Neo with a simple concept of good coffee and good food. Usually the, the first reaction we get is, wow, this is, I can't believe this is in Toronto, yeah. right? And it's, uh, that's exactly what we were going for. I've been in here for a few hours now and kind of watching you guys do your thing and stuff. One thing I've, I've really noticed is like, you're having conversation with everyone that comes in. Like the core foundation of our, uh, our cafe is to build a community. If you can build a community within uh, your customer base, then you'll have a huge regular customer yeah. foundation. Like myself being uh, Chinese and Laotian, and my business partner being Japanese. So we bring this very diverse crowd that comes in yeah. And it's amazing. It's amazing to see people driving an hour or two just to come here on a weekend. Wow. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's so cool. We had the opportunity to meet the roaster behind the coffee at Neo. It's this relationship that Bruce has created that allows him to tailor the blend, which is unique to his little piece of Toronto. I'm one of the coffee shop owners at the Mellow Plata Coffee Roasters. I run my business with my brother, Felix. We get the green bean delivered, like shipped to here, and then we do uh, from the roasting, we do the picking the green bean, the defect bean, and then we roast the bean, we pack, we do the shipment for our wholesale clients. But for example, like Neo Coffee, Bruce knows a lot about coffee, so he wants specific flavor that he wants, and we work together. It's, it's less yeah. about like just straight business, right? Like no. yeah. we buy beans from you, that, yeah. that's it. It's, it's more like you are within this kind of world yeah. together, right? I personally think when you're working in the coffee industry, like network and the friendship, relationship with other baristas, other coffee shop owners, other coffee shop baristas is really important. If you have good relationship with one barista, we get, you get to know other barista, and they get to know our bean. One's coffee beans are sourced from all around the world, and they have a very personal relationship with the growers that supply to them. On the day we visited, we were lucky enough to meet one of the Colombian farmers. My name is Chalo Fernandez. Uh, I'm a coffee farmer from Colombia, five generations producing coffee. My father now is the one who do um, quality control at the farm. My brother is the manager of the farm. My sister-in-law became our accounting. His family, business, yeah, yeah, his family-owned business. And our focus when we start with my cousins, the impact that we give to the community when coffee industry gives so much jobs. So all the community start asking for, for a job to our farm and we notice that some of our workers have their own small plantations. We help our, our community to be able to produce coffee, and as a Chalos Coffee and Coffee Land, that is our exportation company in Colombia, we can export their coffee too. So obviously you mentioned about the community aspect uh, back in Colombia. Would you say that that is as equally important here and the people that you work with in Toronto? Absolutely. Yeah. Like it's, it's, it's one of the things that I discovered about coffee that is more important for me. Coffee is about people. Because for you as a, as a consumer, as a coffee lover, you cannot enjoy a good coffee if you don't have a beautiful people working behind that. Since like my dad and my family plants the little baby trees in our soil, that's where everything starts. And, and that's, that's the beautiful thing about coffee because when we meet people like the Middle Park, like Felix, like Jamie, people who are passionate about coffee, people who care about the farmer, to be able to come and see how is things happening here, that makes him even more proud sure. to be a coffee farmer. Oh. Chalo's passion for what he produces is not singular. Bruce's co-owner began creating his distinctive Japanese roll cakes as an answer to something he couldn't find in other coffee shops. The coffee shop usually had like a muffin and the cookies. I wanted to have more something lighter and less sweet. So then I started making a roll cakes. I was chatting to um, 
obviously Bruce about like what you guys, one of the main things you guys have created here is community. Yes. Um, would you say that that's an important factor for you in having, having a place like this? So we are not just selling coffee or pastry. We wanted to try to create a built community. That's why we don't say near pastry, we say near coffee bar. I was always excited when, okay, my friend's birthday, after work, I started making cake for yeah. friends. Yeah. Think about friends, you know, think about people who eat them. It's huge different. Mm -hmm. So same things here, like when we bake stuff, you know, there's a one customer, he comes every morning buying a croissant. So we bake and keep for him two croissants every day. Oh, really? It's fun mm -hmm. to connect with people, to know them, they know us, to build a community. I think Huma is not designed for being alone. You can buy coffee, say, 7-Eleven, but I can interact with people. It's, I think it's very important to be community. You don't have to get married someone. You don't have to be someone all the time. But I say, at least you say, hi, how are you, somebody? It's already interact. It's, I think it's huge different to mentally, physically, your speech. It's, it's, you need to connect to other people. And that's the crux of it. Humans aren't meant to be alone. Through a specially crafted cup of coffee, a diverse and welcoming community is created.